Well, hey, everyone's drunk on Otaku here. And I had meant to get this up last night, but I went to bed a little earlier than I meant to. But yeah, here we go. We're going to start Black Lagoon here in just a moment. Now, I don't really know all that much about this show, other than it has a pretty good mouth score and a lot of personal friends recommend it as well as other people. So that's the reason I've had it on my uh, plan to watch and um, on the promotional picture, you know, that has some pretty cool looking, you know, art and character designs. But yeah, I'm definitely interested in checking this one out and starting it up here in just a moment. So we're going to go ahead and get this going here in three, two, one. Got an industrial metal opening. That's cool. Justice. All right, so the, the OP is in English. You don't see that very often. I mean, I can think of shows off the top of my head to do, do that, but it's not as open uh, often. <laughs> Shit out of luck. <laughs> the power. Black. <laughs> I like that. Oh, I, that's cool. <laughs> All right, let's see what this is about. I like how everything's grayed out, but he's in color right there. Uh, he's kind of grayed out here, but he's at work now, so that's interesting. Eh, not fully grayed, just kind of everything's duller looking. City of Winter. That's beautiful, man. <laughs> Okay, so doing like pirates, yeah, pirate stuff. <laughs> Not your day, man. I don't think so. <laughs> I like her voice actress. <laughs> okay, so they're Black Lagoon. Legs. <laughs>
Okay. He's right about that. So you guys are up no good. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> He probably pissed himself. <laughs> and if she wanted to kill you, you'd be dead. If she was really intent upon it. <laughs> My permanent record. Yeah, yeah, he's a pretty cool, chill dude for the most part. Even though he punched you in the head earlier. <laughs> Rockero. So they're going to send some mercs after him. Or private security force or something. And yeah, they're going to wash their hands of him. Rucko. You probably need a drink after today, buddy. Exactly. You have no idea where you're at, how to get home. You're dependent upon them. You're still the hostage, man, regardless of they, how big a leash they give you.
Well, it's the kind of place. Yeah. Huge difference. It also seems like he doesn't kill unless he has to. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> That's a combo. <laughs> nice pass. You chug the cheap shit, you savor the good shit, and you're doing a good job, buddy. <laughs> I like that smile. Someone's getting fucked up. Oh, she's got some burns. Or fire acid, probably. Okay. Okay. Yep, that's what happens. Hell yeah. Shit's gonna hit the fan real soon, though. Like now. It's party time. Poor bar. Who tries to walk out like this, seriously, when this is going on? Unless you're really, really shit-faced. <laughs> wow, you bulletproof the bar. Respectable. <laughs> Pretty normal response, bud. Good advice. Two hands. Okay. <laughs> Don't we all? <laughs> hey, 
Hell yeah. She's fucking fast. Well, your asshole's shut. <laughs> yeah. She likes her work. That tea. Yep. <laughs> oh, they're not done following them yet. She's a damn good shot, though, and really moves very well for depending how much, uh, considering how much rum she probably had in her system. I don't think they're going to want him back. Fuck. <clears throat> we'll give you a posthumous uh, promotion and make the president. Ah, uh, yeah.
Can't say I blame him. He's been through fucking hell. These people are pretty chill, but he's still chill considering, but these people still yanked him out of where he was at and fucked everything up. And obviously, <laughs> he's, oh my God, he's being used as target practice and company dished him, told him to go die and God. You, you don't want to die. <laughs> Where'd your gun go, buddy? You're going to need it, probably. One hell of a gun. <laughs> Shit. I can't say I blame him for wanting to jump ship, though, man. He's about ready to snap, though. He's had a real bad fucking day. I guess this is the ED. Yeah, bullet case is dropping. Look, like a cigarette fell. Someone's walking. It looks like in the snow. Or possibly on what pavement. I'm not sure. It's real dark. Looks like it's her, though, based on the legs, but I can't tell for sure. Drew guns fell. Something dropping outside the screen and everything stops moving. Oh, it's a, okay, it's a sandy beach. Gotcha. Boots. <laughs> Hell yeah. Nice. Nice ED. Mangrove heaven. Nice. I think I'm going to jump right into the next one here in just a second. Yeah, definitely a fun fucking show. I mean, uh, you can tell it's going to get pretty damn violent, and I'm fine with that, and... It's going to have uh, some pretty heavy shit. He is having, like, the world's worst day. You know, he gets abducted by these assholes. They're cool assholes, but they're assholes. And, I mean, she's kind of a <laughs> little <laughs> unbalanced with him a little bit, you know. So he doesn't have a good read on her ass, but, you know. Company leaves him out to dry, you know. He's got uh, mercenaries with a hit on him, basically. <laughs> yeah. I can't blame anything he's doing. <laughs> what, the jump ship when the heli attack helicopter came in and say, fuck that, I'm out. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I think he's like this close. <laughs> he's on the edge right now. All right, well, this is Jerkin' Attack. I'm heading out for now. Please like and subscribe, and I will talk to you all later.